try and take this a little bit easier. Yes! Oh! Are you kidding me? We got a boost! Thank you! I'm sorry, bro! Oh my god! Sports Live Train, and welcome back today, guys, to the channel for some more Forza Motorsports 6 action, man. Now, Turn 10 Summer Car Pack got released a couple weeks ago. It was a pretty damn badass pack once you start looking into it, and I mean, it's this solid, consistent pattern that I've been seeing. First off, you know, I see the trailer go up, and I'm like, ah, you know, there's nothing really that I wanted, but more that I dive into the pack, the more I appreciate what has been given to us. Now today though, I'm going to be driving the 1979 Datsun number 33 Bob Sharp Racing 280 ZX Turbo, man. That's, that's a mouthful and a half right there. 750 horsepower, 650 foot-pounds of torque weighing in in exactly 2400 pounds, man. This thing is going to be an absolute beast. I have been dying to drive this. Haven't even bought this yet myself because I've been waiting for today, man. I want to wait and do it live because I feel like this thing is going to be an absolute monster on the track. We're going to be going ahead doing some online racing as well, seeing how it competes on the track. Maybe even Race Boy has a tune-up. I don't know, man. Now let's have a quick look at the paint. Oh, shit, that's nice. That actually, oh my god. Um, I'm thinking right here that ugh, there is some beautiful paints, and it's the wide body that really does give it that aggressive feel. Oh, the JPS? John Player Special? Oh my shit, man. This thing, okay. I don't know what I want to do on this. I'm thinking about the Kenwood. You know what? We're going to do the Kenwood on this, man. I'm going to feel that Kenwood for a little bit. Now, if you guys don't know, this car is also the Nissan S130. That's how it was branded overseas. And look at the ass end on that. Holy shit. That's a long tail and a half, man. God damn. Uh, this is going to be fun, ladies and gentlemen. Definitely will be. Just had a nice plate of waffles with some Aunt Jemima syrup. It was good, man. I still have some milk on deck right now. Some ice milk, actually, if you want to get technical. Let me know down below what you guys were this munching on. 1979 Datsun, number 33, Bob Sharp Racing 280ZX Turbo. She she handled that word better than I did, man. Jesus. Okay. Well, let's go ahead and have a quick look at the Forza Vista. And this thing just, oh, man, it's beastly. Can we pop the hood, though, is the question. We better be able Oh, yes, we can. Okay. Here we go. I'm excited. <sighs> Ooh. Look at this, man. Inline six, if I'm not mistaken. God damn. For 1969, Nissan USA President Katayama began development of an affordable sports car. In Japan, the car would be known as the Fair Lady Z, and elsewhere as the Datsun 240Z. The Nissan Z series would sell over 2 million cars, becoming the fastest selling sports car in history. The fuel crisis of the 1970s favored smaller, efficient cars like the 240Z, and it was an instant hit. With excellent balance and rear wheel drive, the 240Z became a racing powerhouse, winning multiple SCCA and IMSA class championships and first in the East African Safari Rally. The Z car line was updated with the 280ZX and radically redesigned with the 300ZX, 350Z, and 370Z, each generation improving handling, acceleration, and refinement while maintaining what makes the Z car so special, rear-wheel drive performance and reliability at a reasonable price. Where do I want to take this badass ride? I'm thinking right now. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Walk in time, short circuit. Let's get this shit going. As I did say, man, I got that ice milk on deck. Look at this shit. Oh my god, man. It's gonna be nice. Let's have a quick listen while I drink the rest of this. Mm. Okay, got milk? I do. Oh. All right, well, she's sturdy, man. Can't even do a burnout. Hold up. Oh, this is going to be a dream. Barely any wheel spin. The torque coming through this. It doesn't feel it until you hit about 6,000. You can just hear it, man. God damn. 
We are on 900 degrees of rotation. I probably will bring this down for the circuit racing online just because it feels a little bit more realistic on 540 with the wheel. Jeez, it's a monster. Brakes are beautiful. Bringing me to a stop in under what, like two seconds right there? Jesus. See how she does on this? Big sweeper. Waiting to put my foot down on that, man. It's a ride. I'll give her that. Here we go. Here we go. Barely touching that rumble strip. Still, though, it's a very stiff car. It really is. And I definitely feel, though, with a nice proper tune, this is going to be something monstrous. Guaranteed. I want to hit online with this. But we're going to yank the handbrake at least one time. There we go. Oh, shit. It does slide. Okay. Just don't hit the grass. Thank you. A lot of understeer, though. The understeer is serious. Obviously, it is a circuit racing car, so I can see why. But you can still get that damn slide, though. Just a little bit, man. Cockpit view going down. Now, this is an R-Class car, so we're going to have to go into the R-Class lobby. And uh, I'm hoping just to throw on a tune, and this thing is going to be circuit ready. I mean, that's the plan, but we got to worry about everybody else in the lobby, though, as well. I mean, remember, we are online for the Motorsport 6, and it gets treacherous, man. It definitely does. Two out of three laps? I mean, should I wait it out? I mean, ah, shit. Oh, four out of four laps on this one. I like this, and they're finishing up. Let's go ahead and load a tune on here. And uh, what do we got? Race Boy. Oh, he's even got the turn 10 on that shit. Remax Grip. He is now currently... I forget what that's called. It was like a... Um, it was a Marshall, if I'm not mistaken. It was a turn 10 Marshall where he pretty much looks over the lobbies as he's in them and just makes sure that nobody's doing any stupid shit. So congratulations, Race Boy, for earning that badge. That is absolutely crazy, man. Turn 10. Where's mine, though? Come on, man, please. Tuned by Race Boy 77. Livery by... Pity Blue 43. I think we got a pretty good combination going down here. This should lead up for some hella racing. Man, I'm down. Prague. Oh, six laps on Prague short. This is going to be interesting because I don't know how this is going to feel on a shorter track. But I'm definitely going to see. I mean, what else do we have going up against us here? We got a Porsche GT1. That's going to be a badass car, man. We got the number 21 R382. Uh, we have the Lamborghini Gallardo. Okay. Ultimate GTR. I don't know how he's going to do in the corners, man, but have fun with that, though. Uh, he's got the R35. Uh, we got a 458 in the building. Lancia Turbo. Another R35. Okay. Got the Uricon. This should be pretty interesting. And then we have a Subaru WRX 05, man. Pitto 461. If this man wins this race, I'll be thoroughly impressed right now. Whew. Let's get it. I'm going third person now. Screw this shit. Get out the way, man. All right, this is going to be treacherous. I'll tell you that. I just don't want to get... Oh, damn. I thought I was going right. Yeah, there's that Subi. I called it. Jesus. Get out the way, man. The guy bumped him. Oh, that's going to be bad. I mean, at this point, four online racing... Oh, shit. Four the online lobbies. It's really just first come, first serve in the corners, man. I mean, if you don't make it... Be ready to get pushed out of the way because everybody is fighting for that top spot. I mean, they really are, and it's a battle, man. I mean, oh shit, yep, wall ride. Oh, we got air on that. That guy lost it, and I'm still on 900 degrees of rotation. What is happening right now? Why is that guy lagging all over the place? Definitely enjoy this tune as long as you're easy on the throttle. Oh, gotta go, no man. Take care. Holy jeez. We're in third. Take this corner actually properly now. Well, that's not even proper, but I took it well. I took it well. This guy's behind me. We're not going to give him an inch. Maybe we just, yeah, we gave him a couple inches on that one. I'm sorry, man. I'm not the best circuit racer out here. Being on a wheel just makes it even harder. But we'll make do, man. Look at him. He's off my ass. Come on. Oh, shit. Too hot. 
No. Look at this, man. Both. Oh. We're gonna take second. Oh, that man is waiting. Oh shit. Here we go. Here we go. Coming out, final corner. We are slingshotting past that man. This thing is so mean in the corners. It literally just grips. And try to take this a little bit easier. Yes. Oh, are you kidding me? We got a boost. Thank you. I'm sorry, bro. Oh my god. I sallied a little bit too early on that one. I cannot believe that just happened. The understeer, though, man. It's still real. No. I'm going to 540 next race. This is crazy, man. I cannot believe that happened, though. I honestly thought I was good. And then that big ass caught it on the wall, man. Not happy. Here we go. Here we go. Nope. Okay. Yeah, no. I'm going down to 540. This is bullshit. Wasn't my best driving I've ever done before. I'll tell you that right now. Jeez. I cannot believe that. I took all the wind out of my sails when I nicked that wall. Oh, my God. It's all right, though, man. We got another chance here. We're going to go ahead. Oh, we were on damn 720. Okay. Well, we're going to bring it down to 540, though, because that's what I said, man. Circuit racing on 540, I feel, is ideal. If you're on a rig, let me know what's your rotation and your force feedback when you do play, you know, if you're circuit racing or drifting. Always curious to see everybody else's settings because obviously there are so many to tweak and, you know, you can really fine tune a lot of things, even on the PC side of things too, right? So it's just nice to see what everybody else is running in the rig game. What? What? Here we go, ladies and gentlemen. My circuit racing career is... Oh, shit, I'm in third gear. I'm so sorry. This is going to be a battle. Kind of happy that I'm not right up there, though. I'm in last. Look at everybody going off. Take care. Guys. Oh, my God. Wow. That was nuts. Pretty damn crazy that I even made that. I was not expecting to even come out of that. Some days of thunder shit, man. Has so much pull through these sections, and it is so quick. I'm scared, man. I don't know when to break. Having to ran Watkins Glen, the full one, in such a long time. So used to the short track, to be honest with you. Look at this. My apexes are shit. Oh, we got a little bit of contact. Get out the way. Yeah, 540 degrees is so much better for the online racing, man. It really does give you that kind of edge that you need to be able to compete on the track. It really does. 900, you just don't get that range of motion like you should as you're circuit racing. I don't know what it is. Can I fit the gap? I can't. Wow, that was so greasy and I'm so sorry. Jeez, I didn't even think about it. I thought we had a little bit more road to spare and I come in right in the middle like a dick, man. Oh my God, I'm sorry, man. But we're online, fours and six, man. Expect the unexpected, that's all I'm saying. We have four laps of this. I'm in fifth. Oh, I was looking at the names. No, I was looking at JoJo's name. He was talking. I'm pissed. It's all right. I like to battle the pack, man. I do. See, me, I'm not that, like, try hard for first place because, really, I don't give a shit, man. I mean, if I come in first, that's great. I'm going to damn brag about it for years. But if I don't, then whatever, right? I mean, I'm just kidding. Imagine that, though. You get one win, you're just all off. That's it, guys. That's it. That's my last circuit race on Forza 6. I placed first place. Look at the understeer, though, man. The biggest thing is not overcorrecting on the back transfer as you're coming through. Because as soon as you overcorrect it, you lose that traction on the rear end, and then you're really screwed. Oh, shit. Breaking. Still not the greatest on that corner. Or GT, man. You can try. You're not going to pass me, though. Ooh, another damn collision right there. 
Okay. Okay, Mr. Domino. I got you. I got the power, though, man. This thing. See, the braking, though, I feel, because Race Boy's on a controller, I feel the braking should be definitely turned down for myself because I keep locking up these tires, and that's the problem that I'm coming into. I ain't giving you that inside, bro. Get out of here. Guy trying to take my inside from me. I don't think so, my dude. Okay, okay. Keep it clean, man. I like it. I like it. You guys don't know we are on full assist off. I never run with that shit, man. There's no point. What's the point of playing Forza if you're running assist? That's all I'm saying. We're gonna try and save this. Thank you. Here we go. Lot number three, we got two left. And I'm not coming in 11th place, I'll tell you that. I'm gonna be placing in ninth. That's my goal right now, ninth place. It's doable, man, it's doable. Can't tell me everybody in front is gonna have a perfect race from here on out. It's just not gonna happen. Cards are not in their favor. Am I gonna get past? What was that? Look at this guy back there, okay. You can do it, man, run it. Where's my braking markers? Oh. Waiting to put my foot down. There we go, there we go. Oh yeah, he's getting in there. Go for it, my dude, go for it. You earned it. And I'm right there again, man, I'm right there. Oh, son of a bitch. I'm pissed. I'm pissed, man. There goes my uh, ninth place goal right there. Oh my god, 13th. Ladies and gentlemen, I think that's gonna do it for today's episode then, man. I thought I was gonna be in the running for some good contention, but it's not gonna happen. Not at this point anyways. Hopefully you guys did enjoy this episode. I certainly did driving this. And I definitely maybe would like to do uh, some more content with this car later on, maybe as an online session with everybody else in the room and uh, just a nice little live comm. Who knows, man, but we'll see. I'm gonna sit here, slide this out, because obviously my circuit racing game is not up to par. And I gave it a good solid effort though. I, you know, I gave it a good college try. But uh, just today was, uh, wasn't my day on the online side of things, man. I definitely had a blast though. Don't forget to slap that like button. Tell me your thoughts about this beauty down below. And I'll see you guys back here tomorrow for some more content, man. It's your boy the Slap Train. I'm out. Peace. Welcome back guys, 